What's good, everybody? It's your boy Big Smooth here. This little tutorial is actually um, for all your Mac users out there, man. If you're like me, I'm actually right now on Google Images. You know, I do a lot of stuff in Photoshop or whatever. And um, what I hate is, I think like everyone else hate <laughs> when they're trying to pull images off. Sometimes they don't be tr uh, transparent or whatever. And let's just say I'm a pull a random one real in this Superman image right now. See, if it was transparent, you'll see this part here would kind of, the white was fade out. So, you know, what I hate is when you get it and you put it in in Photoshop and you try to remove the white background, kind of hectic. And that's one of my main problems. So I'm going to, I'm doing this short tutorial to show how easy it is. You know, I learned a new way with working with the Mac on how could you uh, take that white background off. So as you can see right now, make sure it's a PNG file. Make sure it's PNG JPEGs. You have problems with I learned trying to take it off or whatever, but make sure it's a PNG file. And what you do is once you pull the image up, you go right here. And if this is not showing everything, you can also you can stretch it out like that because sometimes it'd be like this and you can barely see this select button so if you always pop up like that just stretch it out like this where you can see everything up on the test bar and what I do is go to select go down to instant alpha once I do that hold my left mouse down and what I want to do is highlight with everything right here turn kind of this color sort of like pinkish but you know you'll see so I hold it down. See how it does? If I go further, change the whole, the whole image, fade out to pink. But if you drag it, it'll just do that and you just let the mouse go. And see how the little Martian ass all the way around. So only thing I got to do now is just hit delete. And it's pretty much done. So I'm going to hit delete. Bam. See it fades out. I'm going to save this. To my desktop, boom, rid of it, boom, and here I go the image right here. So what I'm gonna do is I got Photoshop already open, so I'm gonna drag it over to Photoshop, open it up, bam, <laughs> it's nice. See how the white background is gone? It's actually gone, boom. So let's say that's just to make sure. That so you'll see that the Eden or I'm gonna put another I'm gonna put another background on there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on this box, I'm gonna make a box around it. So that way you'll see that the white is totally gone. Bam. You see all of I'm gonna drop this here under that layer. Bam. And there you go right there. Now what I'm gonna do click on this layer because I want to make that S smaller. Command T. Put a little box around. Hold a shift. Always hold your shift button when you get ready to make it smaller so that way it won't be all deformed or whatever. Bam. Hit enter. As you can see, <laughs> it's gone. All the white is gone. Nothing but that. It's a little short tutorial done for people that want to learn how to uh, you know, take the white background off of images because that's one of my main problems. A lot of images that I've seen out there, and I was trying to, uh, oh, it was crazy. You know, I would have to go and trying to erase all the white around it, and then, you know, it just took too much time. So I, I think this way here is a whole lot easier. I hope it's helpful to you, or whatever. Like I said, if you're a Mac user, it's easy. PC is a set, it's sort of kind of look different, or whatever. You can still do it, but. I have a Mac, so yes, I'm sorry for you PC cats out there. Use this. I use the Mac, so that way, to, all I gotta do is bring the image up and highlight it, bam, and just take it away. It's a couple of steps. This your boy Big Spoons. I hope this been helpful for you guys, and uh, please subscribe. If you like the video, share it. Hit the like button. Thank you. You guys have a nice night. I'm out of here. Peace.